Hello, I'm Han Chenxie. I'm going to present our paper, Muscle, Strength in Semi-Supervised Learning via Concurrent Unsupervised Learning Using Mutual Information Maximization. The motivation of our paper is, there's a two conventional semi-supervised learning direction. First one is consistency loss, where feature representation of unlabeled data is forced to be consistent across different model or different variation of each sample. Second one is pseudo-labeling, where unlabeled samples are explicitly labeled and assigned that labels are used to provide superior signals in subsequent learning iterations. When we don't have any label information, unsupervised learning can be used to extract knowledge from the data without using any labels. However, there are some limitations of conventional SSL approaches. For example, we still requires a large amount of label data for generating prior knowledge. Otherwise, it will fall into degenerate solution or fail to assign high confidence labels. Also, bias in the label portion can have a significantly negative impact on the model's performance. And when the label data significantly reduced, the bias will be more revealed. Unsupervised learning also have its own limitation. For example, naive USL methods cannot use the label information when training from scratch, even if label data is available in SSL scenario. Some methods first train the model by using USL and unlabeled data, and then they either freeze the model and train a classifier using labeled data, or they only use the labeled data to fine-tune the model. For solving those issues, we propose our method, MUSCLE. MUSCLE stands for Mutual Information-Based, Unsupervised, and Supervised Concurrent Learning. We're maximizing the mutual information between the predictions of variance of the same sample. And most importantly, we're concurrently using the USL objective along with an SSL model when training from the very beginning stage of the training. Muscle can be used as a standalone SSL method, or it can be added to existing SSL approaches for boosting the performance. We will show some experiment result on this. Here is the training structure of the muscle. The bottom path, the blue path, is the normal supervised learning. We pass the label image to some augmentation method, and then pass the augmented image into feature extractor, classifier, and generate some prediction logics. Then we minimize the cross-entropy between the logics and the ground truth. The upper path, the green path, is the unsupervised learning method, where we first concatenate some unlabeled image with label image, and then pass the image set into two different augmentation methods. One is hard augmentation, another one is weak augmentation. We then pass the two sets of augmented images into feature extractors, classifiers, and generate two sets of prediction logics. One is for hard augmented images, another one is for weak augmented images. We then maximize the mutual information between those two logics. Our final objective is just simply adding the uh, unsupervised objective and supervised, supervised objective together. We evaluated our methods on three benchmark datasets. Cephal 10, Cephal 100, and many image net. We also put a special emphasis on the case where label data is significantly reduced. For showing muscle can be combined with other methods for a further performance increase, we select mean teacher model for consistency loss and label propagation for pseudo labeling. Here's our performance on Cephal 10. We can see the muscle itself can achieve a very good performance. And also, when we combine muscle with mean teacher or mean teacher plus label propagation, the performance is increased further. We can also see that when the label data have significantly reduced, the benefits of the muscle further revealed. The performance boost increased. Here's the result on the Cypher 100 at mini ImageNet. The conclusion is we present muscle mutual information-based unsupervised and supervised concurrent learning. Muscle involves USL in the training process from the very first iteration. Muscle can be used as a standalone SSL method, or muscle can be combined with other SSL methods for further performance improvement. If you are interested in our work or want to know more details, please check out, check out our paper. And if you have any questions, please come to our Q&A sessions. Thank you.